Hi, this is Charles Lewis with another photography money-making hot tip. Back in the old days, before I knew any better, I used to think that my most important piece of equipment and the only thing that really mattered was my camera. I figured that's where all the money came from. But now I know a whole lot better. I've learned my lesson and it took me years and years to learn it. Yeah, you need to have some kind of a camera to take the images and create the images, yes. But there really are three key things that are way more important than the camera, and I call those my tripod of photography success. And that's marketing, selling, and pricing. And today I want to give you a major, major secret that's just made me a tremendous amount of money with my photography business concerning pricing. And that is, you want to give your clients three choices three choices to choose from. Don't just say, you know, my 8x10 costs this much, my 11x14 costs this much, and what do you want to do? You know, Give them three choices, or, or what you call product lines. Okay? So in our studio, and, you, and a lot of people, um, who, who did I first hear? I believe it was Paul Linwood Giddings, great photographer in Texas many many years ago in the 70s taught me this the first time I heard it is that there's a thing in merchandising known as good better and best and that's where you give them three choices of product lines one is fine I mean it's it's still good but then there's a better one that's a little more money and then there's the best one that's the most money and if you do that, the normal personality of a human being, human psychology, is that they, most people will choose the one in the middle. So for our studio, we have our good, if you want to call it that. We don't call, this, call it good to a client. We call it marquee. Our marquee color. And this is a beautiful photography fully enhanced everything is beautiful it looks very nice but it's basically a smooth surface mounted onto either a foam core or masonite if it's a wall portrait you know it's it's smooth it looks very nice high you know the key thing you want to do is even on your lowest product line you still want to do all the, the enhancements so that the photograph looks the very best that you can possibly make it before it leaves your studio. All right, then our second one is Imperial. Okay. And that's, you know, everything that this one is, everything that the marquee is, but instead it has a texture put onto it, okay? So that it sort of has a, a texturing surface to it. All right, it looks a little bit finer, a little bit nicer. The light bounces a little differently when you're viewing it. Uh, it just gives us a little bit softer feel to the photograph. And then your finest is Sovereign. Okay, our Imperial, our Sovereign, is a little, it's, it's got the same basic texture as the Imperial, but instead it's on real canvas. So we're actually stripping the emulsion off of the photograph and then we're embedding the emulsion of the photograph onto canvas, real canvas, and then mounting it, either stretching it into a stretcher frame, which I used to do, but I don't do anymore because we had problems with humidity, or you can mount it onto masonite or onto a nice stiff board. This is our finest, okay? The, the Sovereign is our finest, and this is the one we would like people to invest in if it's at all possible. But you see how more, much more interesting this is? Because if this one is too much money, okay, if they just say there's just no way I can possibly afford that, I can't believe, then you can move down one to the Imperial, which is pretty close. I mean, it's still got some texture to it. It's still got some softness to it. It doesn't have the depth and the beauty of the Sovereign, but it's very nice. Or if they still can't do that, they can drop down to the marquee, which is still very nice, beautifully enhanced. The photograph looks beautiful. They will be very happy with it, but it's the lower uh, investment. So this makes it much better. There's a higher probability that people will invest more money with you because you're giving them three choices instead of just one choice. 
And really what this is, is this is merchandising. That's what this is. And merchandising is a key part of pricing. Now I know you're probably yawning and you're saying, you know, what does this have to do with photography? This is so boring. You know, talk to me about your camera. What f-stop do you like the best when you're photographing a single person, like a high school senior? What's your favorite f-stop? See, I know your ears perked up and you said, wow, yeah, now he's really getting to the good stuff. No. This is the good stuff. This is where the money is in the photography business. Now, if you like this tip and you'd like more free secrets, go to www.cjlewis.com forward slash freesecrets.html. I'll talk to you next time.